What are you waiting for? Come join the Geek Drums Nation. What's up, guys? It's your boy Geek Drums. Um, it's a train going off in the background. Just ignore that. Um, just want to hop on here real quick. Uh, we got some news today. Uh, Disney has delayed Blade, Deadpool Three, Fantastic Four, and Secret Wars. Um, I'm not upset about that. Honestly, um, I think this is a this is the best thing that they could do. Um, instead of trying to pump out so much at one time, they could take their time. They could possibly go easier on the VFX artist, but I wanted to jump on here and uh, read the Variety article to you guys, and uh, you guys just let me know what you think down in the uh, comment section down below. Just let me know what you think. Do you think this is a good thing? Do you hate this? Do you just not care? Are you indifferent to the whole thing? Um, we do know that this was bound to happen. I mean, at least I do. Maybe other YouTubers have had... Uh, excuse me, have had the same thinking uh, when we found out about all that Blade, Blade news about uh, two weeks ago with the, you know, movie basically it, it being a mess so far. Kevin Feige uh, being pulled in too many directions. Mahershala Ali not being happy at the moment with the progress that the film is making. Um, it was supposed to start filming. Uh, they delayed filming um, indefinitely until they can find a director that can happen they could find a director tomorrow. They could find a director in a month or so. It could take them a few months. You know, we, we don't know what's going to happen. But I had the feeling that with this film getting delayed, that they would end up delaying other films that were to come after it. So, you know, I didn't get too attached to any dates because this type of stuff happens. This is Hollywood. This is business. This is how it goes. So let's just jump right into this article. It says Disney has overhauled its film schedule, delaying the releases of Blade. Deadpool 3, Fantastic Four, and other major Marvel properties. As part of the shuffle, Blade has moved from November 3rd, 2023 to September 6th, 2024, which created a ripple on the rest of the MCU, like I said. Uh, Deadpool 3 has relocated from September 6th, 2024 to November 8th, 2024. Fantastic Four has shifted from November 8th, 2024 to February 14th, 2025. That's actually my brother's birthday, so that would be a nice birthday present for him. I should tell him that. Uh, an untitled Marvel film has been pushed from February 14th, 2025 to November 7th, 2025. And Avengers Secret Wars has been delayed from November 7th, 2025 to May 1st, 2026. Another untitled Marvel film set for May 1st, 2026 has been removed from Disney's calendar. Now, my thinking, maybe one of these untitled films is a Spider-Man film. We don't know. But um, as far as it goes for the Avengers Secret Wars, uh, work on that a little bit more. You know, we don't need them back to back like they were planning. You know, um, these films have to top Avengers Infinity War and uh, Avengers Endgame. They have to top those, in my opinion. Um, I want them to get Deadpool 3 as perfect as they can. This stupid train. I want them to get it as perfect as they can, guys, because this is Hugh Jackman's return. I want this movie to be perfect. Uh, Fantastic Four. Um, we've been waiting for this for a while, but again, I want this to be as perfect as they can get it. This is the third time. Technically, fourth, wouldn't it? Um, the unreleased movie, the first two, the duo, second one. Yeah, this will be the fourth time for the Fantastic Four. And I want them to get it right. They're bringing them into the MCU. I want them to get it right. I do not mind these delays. Um, do they suck? Yes. But at the end of the day, it's only to make this next phase of the MCU, uh, you know, better than the previous one. Um, don't push out too much at one time. Take your time. Quality over quantity is my is, that's my motto. Um, the article goes on to say in non comic book news, okay, yeah, whatever. I don't care about any of this stuff, but uh, yeah, I'll link the article down below. You guys, you guys just let me know what you let me know what you're thinking, guys. Um, does this disappoint you? I, I, I hope it doesn't. I mean, I know it can suck if you are looking forward to these movies. But um, they're still coming out. This isn't a COVID delay. This is it, not. It, it Blade just created a ripple effect that was, you know, 
even Eric and Paige talked about this a few weeks ago. This was bound to happen. So when the news came out, it wasn't surprising to me. I saw it and I just shrugged it off because I'm mean, it's to be expected, guys. Like it's it's nothing more we can say about it, really. Um I'm sure the actors appreciate, you know, getting more time. I'm sure the VFX department on each of these films that work for Disney and Marvel Studios, I'm sure they're happy that, you know, they can work a little bit longer and not have to, you know, force stuff out, if you get what I mean. We we all know about those rumors that came out. But um, uh, if you missed the live stream yesterday, you can go watch it on playback. Let me know what you think. It was the Arrowverse 10 year anniversary. Um, this week I will be back with a She Hulk review and a Star Girl review. I'm trying to get back on top of those things so I can keep content coming. Uh, like I said, this was a surprise video. I did not plan on having to make this video, at least not having to make it today. I plan on having to make it later on down the line because, well, I saw this coming. But um, if you like the content here, if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Uh, hit that alert bell so you can get notifications on all of my new uploads and whatnot. Uh, you can always check out my community tab. And uh, like I said, if you're not subscribed, subscribed. Like my intro video says, what are you waiting for? Join the Geek Drums Nation. I'll check you guys later. What are you waiting for? Come join the Keep Drums Nation.